हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सीक्वल इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन सीरीज एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस द इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन फॉर द बी प्रो वन ऑफ माय स्टूडेंट अटेंड द इंटरव्यू फॉर द डेटा बेस्ड डेवलपर एंड दिस इज़ अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन आक्स इन द बी प्रो एंड इफ यू ऑल्सो अटेंडिंग एनी इंटरव्यू and uh, if you have any question or if you not able to solve the question uh, you can share the question on uh, my email id uh, which is mpandeguruji@gmail.com uh, i will also provide this email on the video uh, description so you can uh, send me the all the question which ask so i will provide the uh, video tutorial uh, so i started this series so basically this will be helpful for other uh, people as well who are trying to uh, clear the interview in the field of the sql so this three question is very interesting question asks for the database developer and the candidate having uh, more than 5 years experience so the profile was uh, basically sql plus ssis and uh, so the first question was uh, uh, how to enable or disable indexes in the sql server so most of the time uh, if you working with the uh, bulk upload the data into table and if you have already data in the table so we need to be uh, first drop the index and uh, you can recreate the index but uh, we also have the option to uh, enable or disable the indexes so uh, how you can enable the indexes or how you can disable the indexes the second question is basically what happen if the cluster index is disabled so if you uh, disable the cluster index what will be happen and uh, what happen if the non cluster index is disabled so basically what situation uh, you able to you you will in, uh, enable or disable the indexes so let's start with the first question how to enable or disable the indexes in the sql server Uh, so uh, first time creating one table uh, that is the employee index and i'm inserting the data i'm and creating the uh, cluster index and also creating the non cluster index with the different table uh, i already discussed in the detail last video that what is the cluster index what is the non cluster index so if you didn't get a chance you can watch all this video so basically i created one cluster index uh, ix employee index and one non cluster index i employ non cluster index so basically uh, to disable or enable the index uh, basically you need to be write the alter index alter like table uh, same like we need to be put the alter index or the index name and the table name uh, and uh, you need to be put the disable but uh, when we enable you no need to write here enable you need to be write the reviewed okay alter table uh index name on table name and reviewed okay so this is the basically enable the trigger so so this is the answer of the first question now coming to the second question what will be happen if cluster index is disable so think because uh, the concept of the cluster index is saying that uh if you create the cluster index basically data is got sorted so uh if you create the if you disable the cluster index in this table we cannot pull the data from the table okay let's see the example okay so i have this table okay so cluster index created now i am trying to disable the tab, uh, trigger uh, sorry disable the indexes in this table so let's see uh, i am disabling this uh, trigger so t, uh, uh, sorry uh, indexes so basically this index got disable again and again uh, coming to trigger but sorry this is the index so now if you try to select the data from this table because the cluster index got uh, uh, disable so you will get an error that the query processor is unable to produce a plan because the index uh, uh, whatever the index name on table or view is disable the reason is we already have the table or data is sorted based on the uh, indexes uh uh basically cluster index we created so if you have table and you cluster index is created da so data cannot be pull out okay so that is the reason in practically we not disabling any cluster index okay 
in practical in the real time environment we we, we never disable the any cluster index if you doing any type of the operation now coming to the uh, third question that uh, what will be happen if you disable the uh, non cluster index so i am disabling here the non cluster index so if you disable the non cluster index uh, nothing will be happen you can ins you can uh, pick up pull the data from the table and uh, now coming to the question again they will definitely put you the uh, cross question and uh, if you answer this type of the why we can why cluster index disable and we can pull the data the reason is when you create the non cluster index in any of the table like i'm creating on this table basically they create they pulling the data they creating what data point for separately some type of the pagination of each and every row so that is the reason this will be not affect okay so that is the reason this will be not affect and we can pull the data so in the real time uh, we only disable non cluster index uh, we never uh, disable the cluster index so uh, practically they also want to figure out that you really work on the real time environment or not so that is the reason this type of the question at uh, interviewer ask uh, mainly in the in during the interview so i hope you understand uh, the con complete concept of this uh, all three question if you have any question and if you have any doubt you can just send me the question on mpandegroji@gmail.com uh, or you can connect with my social media platform or uh, you can also put the uh, question on the comment box so thank you so much for the watching this video I uh, will meet again from the inter in very interesting uh, question on next video thank you